Yo, what's up Bali? How you guys doing? Apa kabar? And selamat pagi. You want to stay one year in Bali, one year straight, and it's multiple entry in and out Indonesia as many as you want for one year, and and the cheapest one and the most easy one compared to other kitas. Digital nomad, maybe this one is for you. Watch this video until the end. My name is Oki Misa. I'm your host in Bali. Hi guys, I'm at the Wasab Valley coffee shop in Ubud right now. And look, 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 look what I'm ordered. Look, there you go. Can you see it? Oh, wait a minute. Oops, there you go. Look, this is um, mushroom soup. Mushroom soup with the pastry above it. Look, there you go. This is a mushroom soup. Mm. Mm. Still hot. Let me put this aside first. Let's do this video about the most cheapest way, easiest way to stay in Bali for one year straight. Let me drink my coffee first. Hot cappuccino in the morning. Oh, by the way, let me tell you something. Before we go on with this new way to stay one year in Bali, in Indonesia. Only for this month, April 2024, you can get discount. 30% off by come here order some food make a short video no more than one minute like what I just did you know like hi guys I'm from I don't know maybe Sydney Australia I'm at the wasabi coffee shop and I'm eating the super soup and then you make a comment I don't know it's good it's delicious whatever the good one and then send it to me to my whatsapp number I also mention it down in the description and your video will be posted at WhatsApp Bali Instagram this one so next time when you come back to Wasabali Coffee Shop up in Ubud, just show your video in the Wasabali Coffee Shop Instagram. And you got 30% discount off. So one video for one time discount. If you want to make another discount, so you have to make another video. So it's easy. I'm going to repeat it again. Come here, order some food, make a short video, send it to me through my WhatsApp. And normally within one day, your video will be up in Wasabali Coffee Shop Instagram account. Next time you come here, show the video, and then you got 30% discount. If you want to have another discount, make another video. Easy! But must be different day though. You cannot make the same day. Have to be different day. One day per video. Now, let's talk about the one year visa for you guys. Wait, wait. Is it too bright? Wait. There you go. I think it's better like this, right? Okay. Welcome to What's Up Bali channel. The number one channel for you to know how to go to Bali, how to live in Bali, and condition in Bali now. If you interested on those, consider to subscribe. Guys, the E33G now is getting easier. The easiest and the cheapest way for you guys to stay one year in Bali. One year straight. You don't need to extend it anymore in between. And it's multiple entry visa too. So, you're freely back and forth within one year. And, and, listen. If you got this visa, you can sponsor your immediate family also to stay with you in Bali. Your wife, your children, yeah, they can apply the family kitas. But of course, you have to get your E33G first before you can sponsor them. I think this visa is very suitable for you who want to explore Indonesia or for you is digital nomad, you know, so you can stay in different places in Bali or even in Indonesia we don't have to worry to extend your visa and you still can back and forth to your country but please listen you cannot work with this visa but I mean it's offline but if online of course you can because this actually is a remote worker visa but you cannot work offline like you work in the cafe you work in the yoga place or play DJ model photo no you cannot you cannot work physically and you also cannot open up a business small business maybe renting out a school or something you cannot only online no physical work now how to get this visa first you have to apply it when you are still in your country so before you come to Bali before you come to Indonesia let's say a month before you come to Indonesia second you have to apply it through a visa agency like me this is my email if you want me to do your 3 EEG multiple entry one year visa I'm we'll also mention it down in the description. And then these are the required documents. Photo of your passport, make sure still valid for 18 months. Photo of yourself with wall behind you. Address or place to stay in Bali, your accommodation. And then last three months bank statement with 2000 USD as and balance every month. And then proof of income, 60,000 US dollars for one year. Or contract with a company 
outside Indonesia for one year. Wait, I know, I know. You must be shocked with the last two requirements, especially proof for 60,000 US dollars income for one year or contract with a company abroad. For that, send me email. Not to be worried. Just make sure you have the four first requirements. Photo of your passport, make sure it's still valid for 18 months. Photo of yourself with a wall behind you. Place to stay in Bali and then last three months bank statement. Just send me email. Who knows, I can help you out. Hi, I haven't met you yet. I'm Oki, I'm your host. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Hi, Hi. Okay. Hi. Okay. Okay. Hi. Okay. Hi. Okay, which one is better? This one, the E33G multiple entry visa for one year or the D1 multiple entry for one year? The difference is D1 required you to extend every 60 days and you can only stay up to 180 days and then you have to go out and come back again. And D1 cannot sponsor your family. So if there's three of you, let's say you, your wife and your son or your daughter, all of them must apply the D1. But with this visa, the E33G, first you can stay straight one year and it's multiple entry and then you can sponsor your family, your wife, your children for the family kita. So they also can stay straight one year. So okay, how much? Ah, I'm so sorry, I cannot tell you in this video. I can only tell you through email. But let me give you a hint. The price is less than 1,000 US dollars. Less than 1,000 for you to stay one year in Bali. One year straight, multiple entry. But there's a downside. Of course, there's always a downside. The downside is you cannot extend this visa. So when it's done one year, you have to go out and apply new one. But it's okay, right? You already stay here for one year anyway. So send me an email if you still have a question or you want to go ahead with this visa. So hit the subscribe button for those who haven't and smash the notification bell so you don't miss any update from me regarding how to go to Bali, how to live in Bali and condition in Bali now. I'm gonna continue it my super soon. Until next time.